All right, we're just gonna ca continue on here. Let's upgrade my player here. We'll upgrade the short accuracy. Twenty-five. So, anything else upgrade? Here we go. Consistency. Keep going. What's my goals right now? Zero passing touchdowns. So I have to get up to 15. Weekly. Have no turnovers. Milestone. Three touchdown passes in a game. 400 yards passing. Two rushing touchdowns. And you got five. Wow, there's a lot. Holy crap. Alright. Well, let's continue on here. Hopefully they'll put me in sometime. Oh yeah, I can't do any more game prep. Do some more game prep. Alright, let's see here. Let's earn some XP. Now let's let's get actually on the field this time. Can I is this gonna have me out on the field? The frick. End game drills, there we go. Blitz recognition. do it oh yeah I'm hoping to try to finish the season NBA 2k 15 or Oh yeah, I get an early copy. Now, I mean 2K14. Also known as Cover Zero, is a man-to-man -man scheme that is designed to force the quarterback to quickly get rid of the football. The tricky part about Cover Zero is that it can look many different ways at the line, so it's better to wait until after the snap to identify the all-out blitz. So after you drop back, the true indicator of an all-out blitz will be if there's no safety help. Quick pass concepts, such as slants, are good against the blitz because the quarterback is supposed to get rid of the ball as soon as he finishes his drop back. Okay. Got it. There we go. Get ready! Blue ready, wide! Ah! Screen passes are also good against the blitz since they invite the rush upfield, which may allow the intended receiver to get into open space after the catch. To get that type of result, though, you'll want to throw the screen pass shortly after the offensive line has disengaged from the defensive line. Pass concept. Wow, mother freaker. Well, let's go. One eighty eight. One eighty eight. Ah, Jesus. 
Oh, I'm a failure! No! I've got three weekly time remaining, so... Might as well kick in the next game here, so let's do it. Alright, here we go. No Heidel. And with picture Robert Griffin. It's Peyton May. Block. Hello everyone, I'm Larry Ridley, and this is the NFL on EA Sports. Two running backs will take the field today in hopes of leading their team to victory out on that field. It's Peterson's Vikings going up against Dwyer's Cardinals. Now we'll take you out to the Vikings Stadium where Jim Nance and Bill Sims have the call. It's the NFL on EA Sports. The right. Oh, nice and rainy. Now. Join you from the home of the Minnesota Vikings. Hello, friends. Jim Nance along with Bill Sim. Just prior to kickoff for this primetime extravaganza, and this adds another whole layer of excitement when you have this game under the light. I think you said it right. Center stage players love it. Anytime you turn on the lights, they know it's special, and it brings out the emotion out of these players. And also, though, let's don't forget, the fans, they've been here all afternoon getting ready. So we're going to have a loud crowd also. Peterson All right, Patrick Peterson. Yo. Blair Walsh in position now to get this game started with the opening kickoff. Send the player turn. It looks like I'll be kicking field goals again. Oh, Minnesota's beating Arizona. Wow. Oh, yeah, time to kick some field goals. Ooh, a 48-yard field goal, huh? Oh. There we go. What? What the frick's that bull crap? That was a long field goal try, and when you send the guy out there to kick one that long, you got a 50-50 chance. That time they lost. Oh man, I missed the field goal. No! God dang it! I mean to miss the freaking field goal. Ah. About freaking time. Extra point is good. The Vikings kick return team does it. This is exciting. Exciting. Yes. Oh yeah, we're done with the next game. Woohoo! Yeah, buddy. And I missed a freaking field goal. Mother, that piece of crap! I can't believe it. 